talking about doing a vlog with Jay Cook. He's from Stillwell, Kansas. He's got a rocket called Sea Dragon. It's a 15.7 pound rocket. He's flying on an Aerotech K540 metal storm motor. Uh, he's got a radio tracker, altimeter with the main at 1100 feet. But good luck to you today on Pad 76 where we have a nice clear sky and clear rain. Going in 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, 1. Blue Thunder motor. Love, love me some Blue Thunder. He does have a GPS on board with a main at Jolly Logic popping at 500 feet. So if everybody's good to go and he has read our safety rules, which he has, we'll launch him in five, four, three, two, one. That is a nice straight boost. Oh, we need an event here. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Okay. And the Jolly Logic probably saved him on that one, which is a wild man kit on a K550. He does have onboard video, GPS telemetry with a main at 1,000 feet. So it'll be a really cool flight. Let's launch this in five, four, three, two, one. Just classic motor in the K550. Okay, Wade Thomas, missing a few characters on my flight card, but we'll, we'll assume it's Thomas. From Kingwood, Texas, flying a Skinwalker 300, a lock kit on an I-175 white. He has GPS on this one, always a good thing to fly out of Argonia. He has a Jolly Logic with his main at 400 feet, and he looks like he's ready to go, so let's fly him in 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Okay, let's go out to the 70s pads. Jonathan Gabali from Westport, Massachusetts. His Punisher 3 Wildman kit on an I-599. Altimeter deploy with a main at 600. Let's go ahead and launch Jonathan's rocket. On 77, let's launch Jonathan's rocket in 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Hey, okay. up at the top. Looks like we've got an event. Aaron, you got a spot on that? Okay, we're going to keep our eyes on that one. Whoever has the rocket on 11, you're welcome to put a new igniter in it. Right, his pad on his <laughs> flight cart. I know he's on 32 because I saw the rocket, but we'll shame him for a little bit. From Kansas City, Missouri, is Estes Sumo. Oh no, it's a Sumo Scratch built on an, oh, now I know why, on an I-218R. Uh, it's not a Sparky motor. He does have a radio tracker in it, uh, and he has read our safety rules, so let's fly Taylor in five, four, three, two, one.
Looks like we have an event. <laughs> Good. Move over. Also didn't write his pad number down on his, on his cart. So, from Victorville, California, Formula 75 Mad Cow Kit on an I-500. And he is ready to fly in five, four, three, two, one. That was sporty. <laughs> okay, moving over one more on a radio tracker in this. So let's go ahead and fly Daniel and Heidi in five, four, three, two, one. We just climbed the impulse across there. We have parts. That was an LCO mistake. We were pushing the wrong buttons. That limits your chance for success. Sorry about that, Sawyer. We just wanted to add some add some additional insight into Sawyer's day. So let's go ahead and do 88 again. Sawyer, good luck. In five, four, three, two, one. Now we show we burned it. There it goes. Oh, I hope you're within your cone, Sawyer. And he did light the top. We're going to keep our eyes up there. He's got a altimeter set with a main at 600 feet. Uh, RRC 3 backing up by a Stratowalder. It is the maiden voyage of this rocket. So, Don, if you're ready, let's go in 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. <laughs> okay, let's go to 31. Scott, hook around. Okay, there he is. Good. Want to make sure you didn't miss your flight after the hold, Scott. It's Starship Vega. 2.7x scale scratch built rocket. Beautiful rocket on an Aerotech H128. He has read our range safety rules, so let's fly this Starship Vega in five, four, three, two, one. Okay, we got it under shoot. Um, let's keep a spot on that one. Four, three, two, one. Got a J270 in. This is her level two cert flight. Amber, you got your folks watching? Got a thumbs up. Is it Kevin? That would be a thumbs down. All right. <laughs> Pat 38, good luck, Amber, on your level two cert flight. Going in five, four, three, two, one. We have Dave Devers from Waukegan, Illinois, flying a Wildman Punisher 4. Rocket weighs 15 pounds. It has an Aerotech M1297 in it. This is Dave's level 3 cert flight. And, uh, well, I'm one of his taps, and Tim's other one, and he's been coming out from under his tent there, so he's watching too. He's got a GPS tracker on board, radio tracker, dual deploy, made at 900 feet. The big level 3. Dave, you ready? He is nervous, that is the correct answer to the test question. Pet number 66, it's a beautiful day. Look at the sky, look at the rain. It's going to be a great flight. Dave Devers, level three, going in five, four, three, two, one. Okay.
And we got a Droga. All right. Nice. All right, he's got his main out. Dave, congrats. Welcome to level three. Go down there and block